In this video we share Father James Manjackal on God's punishment is coming. It is time for Europe to wake up and return to the Lord Jesus who is the only shelter and help. You should know that until recently, for example, Belgium and France were Catholic and Christian countries. Now in these two countries, not even 4% of the population goes to Sunday Mass, and that is the minimum requirement for Christian identity. There are many unbaptized children, a large number of men and women live together outside of marriage, few people go to confession or receive other sacraments, and family prayer does not exist. It is true that the prophet Jeremiah said they have abandoned God, the source of life. Divorce, same-sex unions, abortions, euthanasia and every other form of immorality are legalized in these countries. They are like Sodom and Gomorrah. Among their inhabitants there is no fear of God or man. The Lord is certainly not satisfied with this or with other similar countries. I think God's punishment and retribution is coming. Now is the time for people in power and the entire population of those countries to turn their eyes to the Lord and start calling on His name, for everyone who calls on the name of God will be saved. It is time to repent and change your behavior and decide to live in accordance with God's will. The Lord says, Return to me and I will return to you, our God, Jesus, is merciful and gentle. When after Noah's call the Ninevites repented and God repented and changed his plan to destroy them. It is time for Christian Europe to wake up and return to the roots of its life and culture, which is Christ and Christianity. She should give up coldness, lukewarmness and indifference towards Christ and the Church, who alone have answers and solutions to today's problems. If Europe confesses its faith in Christ the Victor, he will stand by the Europeans and put an end to their present enemies. Also, time for the political leadership of Europe to unite in Christ, to fight against the enemy. It is sad that Europe is divided, the enemy uses these divisions. I pray that Europe unites in faith in Christ and the Church and grows in peace and prosperity. I wish and pray that all European Christians will know the power of Christ, their Saviour and Lord. May Mary, Mother of Christ and Queen of Europe, pray for the salvation of Europe. From Father James Manjackal. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.